Good morning, everyone. I just wanted to come this morning before you just to share a few things that were given to me this morning as I was reading and studying God's Word. And I was thinking about fear and how it can really choke you and take over your life if you let it. I'm going to tell you this morning I was realizing how I've been really trying to live by writing out my scripts and making sure that everything was just right and that I wouldn't get anything wrong and that every word would be just right when I come across YouTube and, and the videos and make sure that I don't say anything wrong. But it's always something when I'm looking at a script because I see that my eyes are going from side to side and I'm looking all over the place and I'm trying to be just right because I'm afraid somebody might see something in me that I don't want them to see. Well, healing really begins when we start to let go and let God. The more I sit before the Lord, I see the need to just say yes and let go. Just say yes and let go. Every time I try to come before people and speak, I feel so afraid. I feel like my words are not going to come across as though they can receive it because I don't know what I'm talking about. However, God has given me something to say. He has given you something to say. And I want you to be empowered and encouraged this morning to realize and recognize that no matter what comes your way, don't allow the enemy to attack you to the point where you feel paralyzed, where you feel like you cannot come before people and just say what is on your heart to say. And uh, on that matter of the heart, I'm, I don't want to stay before you long this morning, but I want to share about the heart. This weekend, I, I just took some time away from social media and some time away from uh, my phone just for a little while, just to be in the presence of the Lord. And in that time, he spoke to me and shared with me how it is important to open our hearts to him. If we are afraid, if we are doubting, then it's time to feel, real, realize what those situations are stemming from, what they are rooting from. And they can definitely be shown to you if you allow the Holy Spirit that is within you to start to work. Most people think that the only people who can talk or share are ministers and elders. Now, I have my license to be a minister, but I am a minister because I said yes. And anybody can be a minister if they say yes. So serving others is where my heart is. And I don't want people to feel like they can't come around and see anything they can get from me because I am afraid to share and afraid to give what I know is true. I am so thankful to God this morning because when you open your heart and let him pour in his love, then will you be able to do what you are needing to do for others. Let God pour in his love because God is the only one who can give love. Love does not come from yourself. You cannot give love. You cannot create love. Only God is love. Trust and believe. If you could give love and create love, there would not be as many problems in the world as there are. So it is important for us to learn how to open our hearts, learn how to trust and believe in God and know that he is God and God alone and he will give you what you need in those moments. You have a wonderful and blessed day and I hope you enjoy 
the afternoon and know that God is love and you are loved. Be blessed.